Many terrifying animals live deep beyond the waves, like this vampire squid living 3,000 feet below the surface in almost complete darkness. This animal has a cloak like a vampire's. That's why it's called the vampire squid. Deep down at the bottom, it can't use ink to defend itself. So this animal has developed an unusual tactic. It glows slightly to scare away predators. If this tactic fails, the vampire squid can turn its body inside out, revealing tiny spikes. When you translate its scientific name, Vampirotuthis infernalis, it literally means vampire squid from the nether. Despite its terrifying looks, it's a harmless ocean animal. This previous creature was not from space, but this object definitely is. Before Elon Musk found a way to reuse rockets, NASA would simply drop old ones after launching astronauts into space, most of the time in the ocean or deserts. In 2012, Jeff Bezos launched a mission to find the Apollo 11 rocket. They found it by using sonar, but it was in terrible condition. It was sitting on the bottom of the ocean, not far from the predicted site. They were able to rescue the engine and reconstruct two of them. The most famous lost city is Atlantis, but sadly, we still haven't discovered it. However, Heraklion was also just a myth until one British pilot saw something that looked like a city while flying over the Mediterranean Sea. He reported it, and 60 years later, a group of divers went there. They were shocked when they found an entire city underwater. It was loaded with artifacts that could tell us a lot about the history of the place. Now it's one of the best underwater archaeological sites in the world. It's believed that the rising sea caused the whole city to go underwater. The Titanic sank in 1912. The wreck was claimed to be officially discovered 74 years later. In reality, though, a fisherman found the Titanic eight years earlier while fishing in the Atlantic Ocean. He was pulling out his net when he spotted a head stuck in it. Luckily, it was just a doll's head. Years later, after the fisher had passed away, his son sold the doll to a doll collector. She did a lot of digging and research on every person who had a porcelain toy on the Titanic. She found the owner of the doll. Ava Hart was on the Titanic and had a doll with her. Ava survived the catastrophe by a miracle, but her toy didn't. Hart even wrote about the doll in her journal, and every detail matched the toy found by the fisherman. The tripod fish lives deep in the abyssal zone, around 20,000 feet below the surface. It's adapted to such immense depths and uses its tripod fins to stay still on the bottom. This creature doesn't have big eyes, but even if it did, these eyes would be useless in the darkness. Instead, the tripod fish uses its fins like antennas to detect any movement in the water. This creature doesn't have much luck when it comes to its love life, so it had to develop unique tactics to reproduce. One fish can be both male and female. The next bizarre creature is the lizardfish. It has tons of razor-sharp teeth, a huge mouth, and really big eyes, which it uses for hunting. All this makes the animal look freaky. The lizardfish lives at depths of around 11,000 feet in the midnight zone, where there is zero light. This freak of nature basically eats everything it can fit inside its mouth, from small fish to other lizardfish. On the other hand, when they see other reptile fish, they probably fall in love instead, because finding mates at those depths is not an easy task. Like the tripod fish, the lizardfish can be both male and female at the same time. When you think of a river, you usually picture it on land. Still, nature is quite unpredictable, and it created a river flowing under the ocean in California. It's running at a depth of around two miles. This river has everything that an ordinary river has, sunken logs, trees, and rocks. And despite its uniqueness, it's not the only one in the world. There are also others in the Amazon and Greenland. 
A terrifying creature was discovered near Angola's coast by a remote operating vehicle. It looks like it doesn't have a head or a body. It was sitting at a depth of around 4,350 feet below the surface. After doing research, scientists concluded it wasn't anything from a sci-fi movie, it was just a cluster of siphonophores stuck together. In 2015, some random guy was diving in Caesarea, and something shiny caught his eye. He reached out, grabbed it, and realized it was a gold coin. After that, he examined the bottom and found out that there were many more. He reported the incident to the local authorities, and they concluded that he had found Arabic treasure. The coins were made of solid 24 karat gold and were a few thousand years old, but due to the perfect salinity and temperature, they looked brand new. The coins belonged to a ship carrying cargo. It was caught up in a storm and unfortunately sank. One of the weirdest things ever discovered was found in the Baltic Sea. It's an anomaly that looks as if it was created by a different civilization. It was discovered by Swedish researchers, and they basically had no idea what it was. They had to ask tons of other scientists for their opinions. When you look at this formation from above, it's 200 feet long and looks exactly like a fallen spaceship. It's hard to believe that it's a natural formation, but spoiler alert, it's totally made by nature because the Baltic Sea has gone through many erosions throughout history. Most likely, the bizarre formation is the result of these processes. A group of divers in Madagascar were shocked when they found this seven-foot monstrosity of a knife on the seafloor. The speculation started immediately, and many said that the knife was from some giants that had fought megalodons and lived on Earth thousands and thousands of years ago. That could make a nice story, but the knife is most likely a movie prop that was lost at sea. One of the ocean's most bizarre animals is the frilled shark. It's believed that this fish is the reason for all those sea serpent stories that sea explorers of the past wrote about. These animals live pretty deep in the ocean, but sometimes they can be seen in shallow waters. It's super rare, but possible. The frilled shark has a big mouth sporting around 300 teeth. It also has a long body that looks like a lizard's, and it is truly a unique species of shark. Its prey can be half of its size because this shark's stomach is like that of a snake, and it can swallow huge fish or crustaceans. Spotting a few worms in your garden is no big deal, but after seeing a 26-foot long one in the ocean, you will make your wetsuit a little wetter. This worm is super rare, and it's completely harmless to humans. It's actually not a giant worm. It's a cluster of zooids that are stuck together in a worm-shaped formation. They usually only eat plankton, bacteria, and other tiny things that can be found in the ocean. Probably the scariest thing in the ocean that is 100% real is the Magna Pinna, which can be found at crazy depths of 20,000 feet below the surface. This monster looks like an underwater slender man, but it's just a squid with really long tentacles that can reach a terrifying size of 8 feet. This guy has only been seen a few times, and basically, we don't know much about this creature so far. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.